Good afternoon, Moreau Catholic High School. This is Justin Deep Singh Olick here, your everyday man, oh giving you the weekly library podcast. So, let's start off with the most important news of the day. With my two guests, I'll introduce them. William Miller, Robert Kionis. Uh, William, what is the most important news of the week? That would be the library news. All right. Robert, what's the first thing on the hit list? Well... He doesn't know. He doesn't know. I think that would be live at MCHS. Okay. So, for those of you that don't know, we just had a live... Our second live at MCHS event. It was here at Moreau, and uh, William Miller, one of our own, was actually part of that event, and we'll be happy to tell you about his thoughts on that event right now. Well, as you may or may not know, this uh, live at MCHS event was all about pop culture. So what we ended up doing this time was we had a panel of very, very highly esteemed students and teachers, and a wonderful moderator in the name of Mr. Baptist. What ended up happening was there was a large amount of ideas and contribution from both students and faculty, and it really bridged the gap between what students think and what teachers think. It gave a good insight into how teachers aren't just teachers, they're people, too. And it's a great example of how that can happen. And uh, I was Kanye, so naturally I thought it was amazing. But what were you for the Live at MCHS thing? No, I'm kidding. Okay. Um, what else? You know, I know, uh, Robert, I'll get you on this one. So Thanksgiving just uh, happened. And, uh, what does that even think about that? mean? Oh, well, Did you, you get know, any good food? Well, yeah, well, I mean, it, 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 that, it just comes with the territory. I mean, last week, you know, you guys had that three days, and then break and all that stuff. I was sick the entire time. I was oh. actually, I was out. No, you know, it was actually not that bad. It was just, it was just, you know, it was well. Anyway, um, let's get to the food. The I, main what, part of Thanksgiving. Thanksgiving. Oh, well, well, actually, the main part of Thanksgiving is being thankful and being coming together as a family and for coming together as a family. For. But the second most important part is the food. What did you eat? Uh, when 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 at my Thanksgiving dinner, we uh, whatever. Uh, we're we're we're, fil- we're basically part Filipino, right? So we had like chicken adobo, rice, different kind of rice, Latin rice, and then of course we had you know like our the mashed potatoes, the turkey, mm-hmm. etc. Yeah. Uh, I didn't. I didn't go overboard. You know, I just had enough See, to get, that's, get good. You know, I'm not trying to stuff myself or anything. That's what I always find so interesting because every every family will have a turkey. You know, you got that turkey, but it's the extra things. You know, that really shows. Like obviously, I had you know some uh, curry and rice and just some you know some bread and some yeah, non yeah, Indian yeah, dessert. Non-bread. Yeah, non bread. Non's actually non-bread. amazing. Uh, non-bread. Indian like, desserts. Shout out to Indian food. Yeah. Yeah. Like, yeah. And, you know, and it's just it's just the sides that really make it, you know. And then, uh, like, what did you have? Like, like, my family has, like, cranberry. Like, I mean, they have all kinds of stuff that you wouldn't... Okay, you wouldn't know what a poomsh tort is, but if you would, it's delicious. Is it? It is. What delicious. is a, a poomsh like tort? Poomsh tort? It's like a cake. It's, wow. It's really amazing. It's Hungarian. Oh, oh you're, you're Hungarian? Hungarian? I'm Hungarian. Why didn't I didn't know that? <laughs> well, now you do. <laughs> wow. Well, well library my pod. eyes have been opened. There's your fun fact of the day. All right, I'm glad, because well, well, uh, well, speaking well, of the fun fact of the day, we should also go with the book of the week. Oh, book of the week. Okay. Who could forget that? The book of the week this week is going to be uh, a kind of a tough book for a lot of you guys. Because uh, it's a tough book for me, uh, and it's The Fountainhead by Anne Rand, and I don't know if I'm pronouncing that correctly, but it's uh, it's one of her three most uh, esteemed books, The Fountainhead, Atlas Shrugged, and Anthem, and it's a hugely uh, philosophical book that talks about how man's ego... Anne Ryan is her name. Anne Ryan, Ryan. is it? Oh my god. Um, that talks about how man's ego is essentially the source for all uh, human uh, evolution. You know, it's, it's a crazy book. I've only read uh, up to uh, the second part of the introduction. It's uh, no, I've tried. That might sound like not much, but it's really hard reading. I mean, and a lot of people might know. Fun fact: for those of the fans of the game Bioshock, the book that she wrote, Atlas Shrugged, is has a heavy part in mm-hmm. Bioshock, mm-hmm. just so you know. So that's two fun facts well, for the day. That's great to know. I didn't know either of you could read, so... Well, we do, so that's fun fact number three. There's your third fun fact for the day. Moreau Catholic High School will leave you with those three fun facts, and uh, that'll be our library. Uh, anything else, William Miller? I'm um, happy to have a Thanksgiving, and I'm looking forward to next week. Uh, anything else, Robert Keonis? Counting down to days to Christmas break. That's all all right. right. Amen. Already and, open my advent uh, calendar. Sorry for waiting so long for this library podcast, but uh, stay classy, Moreau.